Hey guys, so where I live at the moment, it is September the 18th and this is the day when Apple's gonna release the final iOS 7 public to everyone. So uh, if you are watching this video on September the 18th or after this day, then you should soon be able to download this. Uh, so. I made a lot of videos on iOS 7 and I'll definitely will making be probably make more videos because I've been getting a lot of requests on different things. So you'll be able to download it. Uh, here I do have my iPhone 5, I do have my 4 and my 4S and then also my iPod Touch uh, all here running uh, iOS 7. Which, which is awesome. So some of the new additions that you're gonna get if you've never seen iOS 7 before is first, you can swipe up from the bottom, you get control center, quick access to brightness, uh, five different toggles, a player, a music player, okay, awesome stuff, a flashlight, and that you will bring up like this. Wow, awesome, awesome, great, perfect. That looks pretty dope. I have also quick access to some other things here, like the, the clock app. Uh, what else fun here? A calculator, quick access to that in the new iOS 7. Uh, and then also you do get, <laughs> of course, quick camera access here. Sweet stuff. Um, let's see here. Uh, what you also do get here is if you double tap, of course, the multitasking is a little bit different now. Uh, instead of having those small little uh, things in iOS 6 multitasking, you get big thumbnails. And you can swipe to remove something. Great stuff. This is what uh, how it looks when you go down. Let's see here. So you can see that you get like a transparent and that's like awesome stuff. You can see what's happening today, all and missed calls and everything. Uh, that's gonna be loaded into that little thing. Siri has been up, 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 upgraded in how it looks. Let's see here also, this is the new viewfinder, how you get access to it. Um, what is the clock? I can't show your world clocks list. What's the time right now? It's 2.57. Thanks. That's what I figured. <coughs> yeah, I know. I know. So, there's a ton of things also in Siri that I can go over if you want separate videos and that. I've already making a ton of videos though. Uh, wallpapers, of course. As you can see, you see a brand new wallpapers here. Especially the, the, the new dynamic wallpapers, which looks amazing. Uh, pretty awesome stuff. Uh, you have also a bunch of new still pictures here, which is awesome. Uh, also great. Of course, all of the various different apps ha have also been upgraded, like the Safari browser, uh, different apps, uh, the camera app, which I did show a little bit earlier. Uh, so that is things that, that can definitely go over, I mean, even though I've already done it a ton of times, but people, people never get bored of it. You can also, of course, see all of these new icons. Uh, and this new color uh, theme here that they are having, uh, which, which is also pretty nice. It's, it's pretty insane, pretty awesome, pretty great. Uh, let's see here. You can also see in here uh, that you do get different menus that looks, uh, that also has this uh, kind of like up updated theme and look to it, which just is pretty goddamn sweet. So, um, I'll be, you can tell me if you want me to do a specific video uh, on a specific device. I mean, I, I do have most of these devices. Of course, this update also will come out uh, on a few different iPads and iPod Touches and all that kinds of crazy stuff. I've been seeing a lot of people want me to do some kind of battery tests and that would be awesome if you know any specific apps uh, where, you, <laughs> where you can try that out because that, that would just be totally awesome. Uh, one thing here that's pretty fun about the iOS 7 update for the iPod Touch is that if we're going to wallpaper and brightness, you get a different tone on all of the dynamic wallpapers, uh, just so it can match 
the iPod Touch colors. So that was pretty interesting, I think. So leave requests down below if there's a specific need or a specific thing you want to see more of. Uh, I've been reading a lot of comments and I've been making a lot of videos on things that people uh, have been requesting. So yeah, quickly a video. And uh, one thing that's also a little bit cool here is that when, if you do have a white iPhone, or at least the iPhone 5, you should be able to see a pretty cool thing when we load this up. So I'm just gonna close it first. Let's see, can we close it? Can we turn it off? Can we, can we, can we, can we turn it off? Yes, maybe. Let's see here. Come on, boy. Come on. It's still a little bit slow, booting down. But this is the cool thing here. You get a white background and a black Apple logo if you have a white iPhone 5. Or at least that's what you should be seeing. If you don't see that, well, then that kind of sucks as well. I mean, it, it is pretty cool. It is pretty awesome. So, um, are you gonna upgrade? You, you will probably upgrade. It's pretty stable. Have a good day.